every country need a lot of flexibility and Spain clearly has a prominent role I think in the energy transition in Europe for obvious reasons um, because uh, of the massive amount of renewables that already are installed in Spain but especially that they are going to be installed in Spain in the future uh, and this translates directly in the need of flexibility and flexibility uh, is completely untapped so um, we are moving towards clearly flexibility that is just coming from the big generators and now from decentralized energy resources and we are working every day to try to make it happen. Distributed energy resources and, and demand side, including loads, clearly uh, this is not easy and uh, all the provisions of the clean energy package still need to be implemented, uh, which is, I think, one of the main blockers that we are facing right now in Spain, as in many other countries. I'm Italian. This is a very similar, similar situation in Italy, to be honest. Uh, but uh, there are a lot of people working to, to, to make it happen. And I really think that we, we need it. This is not, a, like a, uh, a, not an option, let's say. So, um, and the point is that clearly this is a process. Uh, we cannot think that this is going to happen overnight and uh, uh, we need to create a business model that actually works and probably the lack of uh, a clear revenue stream uh, is, is one of the, the other main blockers besides the regulatory ones that I was mentioning just before. But again, uh, this is something that is just going to require time. The regulators are quite willing to, uh, to push in this direction. Um, but I think that we should move a little bit faster. A very good start would be to implement all the provisions of the clean energy package. So to try to open all the, all the markets uh, and to create like a level playing field to all distributed energy resources, uh, including demand, including loads. Uh, again, this is happening, uh, but it's still quite slow. So uh, when this will be possible for all the players and uh, to, to, to participate in all the markets with any kind of resource, uh, then it will be much easier to see the positive effects of demand side flexibility that for now uh, we are seeing them, but uh, for the most part are kind of theoretical. I think that the, the only thing that, that can actually happen with uh, this growth of, uh, of, uh, of renewable energy is that this will, will be a very um, digitalized and very participated energy sector that, and, and an energy sector that can be very important not just for the country itself but also for Europe. We are kind of unifying all the, all the electricity markets uh, so in 10 years actually we're, we're, we will not be talking about the Spanish electricity market, we will be talking about the European electricity market and this would be I think also very positive because with, with, the, with the renewable generation that, that there is in Spain that can be exported also in other countries I think that and, uh, this, this can be positive not just for the country itself but maybe for the whole Europe.